It was six years. It was an incredible journey for all of us. For me, it developed my sensibilities, sharpened my sensibilities in a, as a choreographer, developed me as a director, mandated that I become a producer. Um, I became, it was like going to film school in a way at the same time that you were doing something that you loved and there was always so much at stake, so much at stake every week, week to week to week to week. It was that way from the beginning to the end. I was there as the character Lydia Grant and also the choreographer and soon to become the primary director, developing and, and really teaching those young kids I never had a day off. On Saturdays and Sundays, they were at my house rehearsing. We only had two days to get those numbers together. Two days. And there was a lot of work that needed to be done. And there was no pattern for me to follow. Bill Spencer, our cameraman, our DP, actually took me back in the editing room to show me the archives from the old MGM movies. I would write out the dance action, the lyric, the how much music, and then I would write out the ca the camera moves. And then nobody taught me how to do that. I just knew I had to communicate to everybody, this is what we're going to do. So he took me back in the editing room, and it was so much the same. It was incredible. Um, so there was a lot at stake. I had a lot of so talented and gifted young people that were unbridled and undisciplined, in particular my my baby, Jean Anthony Ray. I was always minding him, always, always, till the very end with him. So how long would you have to choreograph a number and teach it before you had to shoot it? Two days was all we had on Fame to choreograph, teach, and get a number camera ready. Wow. We had that wonderful rehearsal hall. There's a picture of me, Jean Anthony Ray, Fred Astaire, and Ginger Rogers in that rehearsal hall A. That was the same room that they rehearsed in. And when they came, they were so thrilled to come back and they loved what we were doing on Fame. They loved us and um, that room was the room, um, rehearsal hall A. I think it's a costume room now, unfortunately, but 